in the river, and people who live nearby say no one was cleaning it up. That is, until today. Our Sports News' Ryan Duffy joins us live from Springfield. And Ryan, some of that trash is gone, but neighbors are sure it will be back. That's right, and at one time, Hogan's Creek here may have been a nice place to go on a nice day like this, but these days, it's no picnic because of all this trash. Neighbors in Springfield who like to go down to the water's edge know there's something scary hiding under the Hogan Bridge. It's not a pretty sight. It's piles of trash all along the bridge and in the water. It looked like someone took a bunch of garbage bags and ripped them open and just dumped them all over the sidewalk. I mean, the trash was, you know, an inch or two inches thick from one end of the sidewalk to the other. Joey Marchi, who lives in Springfield, took these pictures of the mess yesterday. He says trash accumulates here until it's unhealthy, collecting all over the bridge on both sides of the water. Yeah, unhealthy looking piles of garbage. The neighborhood has even organized their own cleanups, but the trash always comes back and bigger than before. So who should clean it? The city's solid waste department told us it was the city parks department because the bridge went between two parks. They told us the area falls under public works. But sure enough, right after we called checking on this problem today, the Hogan's Creek Bridge went from this to this. Garbage gone. Well, I'm happy that it was done so quickly. Within a day, it was cleaned up. So what's happening is this area is kind of falling through the cracks. The park is well maintained, but the trash just keeps building up here. Joey just wants someone from the city to check every once in a while to make sure the trash doesn't get as bad as we saw it today. Reporting live in Springfield, Ryan Duffy, First Coast News, your news leader. Ryan, do we know which department actually came in and cleaned that mess up? Uh, we think it was the Parks Department, but once we started calling, they got right on it. Okay, thanks very much for the new information.